I think Ghoul is a really fun name, and it's a really cool bot. I'm Paul Tortoresi, and this is my 30 pound robot Ghoul. I work at a surgery center, and one of the eye surgeons there told me that there was this organization that you can go and fight. I worked on cars, I know how to do a little fabrication. So how does a robot compare to working on a car? Not too much at this point, but a little bit of metal working and a little bit of welding helped me out. And I was into RC cars growing up, so these are a lot like RC cars, more so than what people would picture as a robot. Ghoul improved over time through trial and error for the most part. I started with a robot called Smack-O-Lantern, a brick with a drill sticking out of the front of it, and it worked terribly. But I really don't have much of an ego, so I just kept iterating till I got something that worked a little bit. And then I had changed the robot so much that I just kind of came out with Ghoul. I went with AR500 front armor, and the weapon should be spinning a lot faster. We have Ghoul. Highest ranked bot in the weight class right now in Ghoul. Right. We are getting down to it. Fight. Good spin up from both. Oh, oh the wheel. Hit. Ghoul hits hard now. Oh, it does look like it deformed that blade. Paul Tortorici living up to his number one seed with a bot that can take those hits. Absolutely impressive.